And we do have our defending champion, center of the pole from the Western Delaware Wahoos, Caitlin Fitzgerald. As we mentioned earlier, Poniger next to Fitzgerald was fourth last year. Schneider from York and York County, one of the training partners and teammates for Pottinger, was second last year. Katie Pestricelli, third last year. She's in lane number six. So a lot of returners this year in our 800. So Fitzgerald just over her pace from last year where she was a 9.08.20. We'll see what she has on the backside at 100 through. So Pottinger and Schneider, 2-3. Following Caitlin Fitzgerald. Top three times coming out of this morning's heats, Hayden Penny from Greater Spartanburg, she was 9-16-43. Catherine Simpson from Hickory, North Carolina, she was 9-20-09. And Catherine Bouchane from Farmington Valley was 9-20.84. So coming up on the 200 mark, Fitzgerald at 211.49. About a half a second over where she was last year. Pottinger at 212.95. About three seconds ahead of where she was last year. Caitlin Fitzgerald, Western Delaware, still your leader. McKenna Pottinger, second, and Katie Pestricelli from Greater Somerset County, now moving in the third. So now Fitzgerald moving ahead of her pace from last year. Keep your eye on Pestricelli as she's picking up some speed here before we reach the halfway mark. 16 lengths of the pool. For those of you who like to sprint, We'll see what Fitzgerald's going to be holding here on her 50 as she gets halfway through. Looking to get below that 430 mark where she was last year. She could very well be there. She is. She's ahead of last year's pace now, as is Pottinger. Pestricelli, third, third last year. Also well ahead of her pace from 2022. So just over halfway through, 800 meters of freestyle. We welcome those watching online. 
The bottom of your screen is lane number one and the top of your screen is lane number eight. Okay, Lynn Fitzgerald at a 34-34. Edging out just a bit on the rest of the field. McKenna Pottinger, Katie Pestricelli, Battling it out for second. And we're at 5, 37, 87, low 34 for Fitzgerald. 300 to go. So well ahead now of her pace from last year. She was 9.08. Still holding those low 34s. Caitlin Fitzgerald now moving up. Zoe Snyder out of lane number five. Also lane number one, Izzy Pfeiffer. Now here comes the York ladies. 600 through. 646.72 for Fitzgerald. About three and a half seconds ahead of her pace from last year. A low 34 again. Give her a wave, give her a holler as she goes by. All these young ladies will be moving up on the bell lap. Looks like Fitzgerald, Pottinger, Snyder, Pestricelli, Pfeiffer. Oh, Fitzgerald looking to defend her title. 755-56. Four seconds ahead of where she was last year, trying to get below that 905 mark. Snyder at a 33-62. Zoe Snyder, runner-up last year, 50 to go, when the feet pound the pads. Pottinger, 32.02. So here comes Caitlin Fitzgerald, ladies and gentlemen. Give him a wave when she goes by. Battling for second, but here comes the defending champion, Caitlin Fitzgerald, going 903. 66. Caitlin Fitzgerald, a great swim, followed up by McKenna Pottinger and then Zoe Snyder here in our final heat. And let's put our hands together for the 800 freestylers on the women's side. Great swim. Caitlin Fitzgerald going 903-66. Please report to the award staging area.